welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a full day of eating. Like I mentioned in the last vlog, <laughs> I realized I was doing them like once a week or once every other week and then all of a sudden just kind of stopped. So full day of eating today is, or today I'm 27 weeks pregnant. It's the last week of the second trimester. Isn't that wild? I feel like it's going by quickly. You think so too? So anyway, welcome to the video. Show you everything I eat today. Obviously I'm eating in a surplus right now, around 300 calories above maintenance as recommended in the second trimester. Starting next week, it'll be like 450 to 500 calories um, above maintenance, but we just finished up at the gym. I did a Stairmaster and yeah. I, this is the first real meal. I had my coffee this morning. It was a half calf with creamer. Very good. I've been normally putting my collagen in there, but I did not do that this morning. So I'll have to have my collagen later, but frozen mocha smoothie from Lifetime. And I will see you guys at my next meal. Home, showered, put on my Saturday comfies and we cleaned up a little bit and I'm starving. So we're about to make lunch, but today's video is actually sponsored by Caraway Cookware and we are so excited because look at how beautiful these pots and pans are. I got a four piece pot and pan set. There is a saute pan, a fried pan, a saucepan, and the Dutch oven, which we have not really had a saucepan this whole time. So Chris is personally very excited about that. And it's also really cool because it came with these magnetic, organizers which i'm very excited about i really enjoy being organized and i feel like pots and pans are really hard you're not necessarily supposed to stack them especially with these ceramic pans you're not supposed to so this makes it super simple you can organize them however you want put them in your cabinets i know some people leave them out i personally will not do that but we chose this gray color they have a bunch of other colors to match like whatever vibe you're going for but I feel like they're all very simplistic. This four piece set also comes with this hanger to hold all of the lids that go with the pans, which is really nice. Chris and I are not totally sure. I don't think it's gonna fit in our cabinets because we didn't redo our cabinets when we, we just repainted them. And this is, I think, a little taller than ours allow for. So we might hang it in our pantry. Either way, still very excited because this is just like so neat and clean and I love it. Obviously this is gonna be our first time cooking with it so I will totally report back and like update you guys as we cook with them more. I'm gonna start off using the frying pan to make some lunch and we'll just kind of see how it goes. I will update you. These also have specific care instructions that I will have on the screen and chat about in a little bit. But first, let's make some food because I'm hungry. of the day I have very typical uh, breakfast for myself or breakfast lunch I can have breakfast for every single meal of the day I love it I'm also training uh, Lulu right now so don't mind that but I have the Dave's killer everything bagel delicious with whipped cream cheese I 100% meant to do peppers and onions with my eggs but I was hungry and totally forgot so I just added spinach in there. There's two whole eggs, a handful of spinach and some cheese. And then I added some extra egg whites to it. So this is gonna be my next meal. I, I have more than three meals a day, so I don't, I mean, you could consider it lunch, but meal two of the day. The pan was great so far. Chris is set, you say you're gonna cook chicken in there? Chris is gonna try cooking some chicken in the saute pan. I used the fry pan for the eggs and it was great. The one thing they say in their care instructions is to only use wood or like the silicone spatulas and stuff like that, just utensils so you don't scratch it. Obviously that would ruin the nonstick surface and to not like immediately put it into the like run it under cold water because all of that can damage the nonstick. And obviously we want it to have like the best longevity uh, as 
I can. So I'm gonna enjoy this. the day is a Dan and Light and Fit vanilla Greek yogurt, blueberries, and apples. <laughs> or not apples, grapes. Because we're out of raspberries and blackberries. I totally thought that they were still fine. They were not. So is this kind of a weird combination? Yes. I don't think I've ever put grapes in my yogurt before, but it'll be fine. And then I put um, some chia seeds on top. chicken stir fry we kind of just used whatever we had at the house we had most of it but we didn't use like we didn't cook our own rice we just used a brown rice and quinoa one of those like microwave packets that we had and there's broccoli in there peppers onions carrots egg and chicken that we already had air fried we just cut that up and egg if i didn't mention that but looks so yummy. I haven't had stir fry in a long time. Definitely haven't made it at home in a very long time. So I'm excited for this. The pan was great. We used the lids. The lids are ceramic too. And we're just hand washing everything. And I know that's something we did with our old pots and pans that we shouldn't have. Definitely decreases the life of them. So we're gonna be very adamant about hand washing. <laughs> um, and then you don't use any of like the aerosol like sprays use a little bit of olive oil or butter or something like that but a little bit goes a long way since they're so non-stick so we're gonna enjoy dinner and i'm definitely gonna need something sweet after this i got done editing a vlog had a very productive day <laughs> The day i made my clear skin cocktail well i guess it didn't have greens in it because i already had a good amount of fruit and vegetables today but i had my collagen immunity and essentials basically added the essentials for flavor showed you that but i didn't talk to you so i had that drank that it was great i have a handful of some veggie straws because i love them and this is what Chris and I do with our candy. Any, we always have like at least one or two of these filled up around the house with all three sizes of the candy because I personally love the original chews, but they're all really good. And it's kind of fun to just like grab a handful and have a little bit of each. So that's what's in here is one of each of the bags. Probably have a couple handfuls of these, like a serving, <laughs> um, probably like a serving of each of these and that is going to be it. So thank you so much for watching the video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Thank you so much, Caraway, for sponsoring the video. We love the pots and pans so far. I am going to try to figure out where we can hang the lids because I love the fact that it comes with that. We might just hang it in our pantry. I think that's going to work out really well. But I do have a code with them. It gives you 10% off. That is linked down below. And if you have any other questions, comment down below and I will try to get back to them. And I will keep you updated the more we use them but so far really happy that stir fry we made was like kind of just like I said last minute we just kind of threw things together that we had that was really good we both went back for seconds we have a little bit left but yeah it was just the only thing I forgot to share that was in there was the light soy sauce and corn Corn is not normally in stir fry, is it? I don't know, but it was really good. <laughs> so I had the initial bowl I showed you and then I went back for a little bit more. It was delicious. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys in the next video and I hope you have a wonderful day.